So in this video, we have to solve the system of equations and this topic is from matrices and linear system of equations. So here we have to solve the system of equations. So first of all, we have to check whether the system is consistent or inconsistent. For that, the quotient of x is equal to 1. So this I am writing in the matrix form. The system of equations can be written as for the quotient of x is equal to 1 for quotient of y is equal to 1 and z is equal to 1 and here in the second equation the quotient of x is equal to 2 so here it is 5 and here it is a 7 and the next one the quotient of x is equal to 2 this is 1 and this is minus 1 into this is x y z is equal to so the value here is 9 this is 52 and this is 0 and this equation can be written as ax is equal to b. So, this is of the form. So, in order to solve the system of equations, we have to check its consistency. So, first, in order to check its consistency, so we have to frame an augmented matrix. So, which is nothing but the augmented matrix is The augmented matrix is this is A by B. So, which is first of all, we have to write this one first A 1 1 1 and this is 2 5 7 and this is 2 1 minus 1 and the next one. So, we have to add up this column here. So, this will be 9. See here, this is 9, this is 52 and this is 0. So, again, I am separating these two a partition so first of all as you know that we have to use the first diagonal element and we have to make these two zero so this is the common part the common thing so r2 we have to make zero so r2 affected as r2 will be as it is 2 as it is we have to multiply r1 with 2 and subtract that is 2 r1 and the next one in order to make this r3 0 so r3 will be as it is we have to multiply with 2 and subtract so r3 will be r3 will be as it is minus this is 2 r1 we have to use only this r1 to make these two elements 0 so for that see here row 1 is not changed so this is 1 1 1 and this one is 9 so this value is 9 and here the row 2 if you see here what is the operation on row 2 here the operation on row 2 is row 2 is this is row 2 minus 2 r1 what is row 2 here see it is very clear 2 5 7 52 this is 2 5 7 and this is 52 minus in between we have to multiply r1 with 2 so this is 2 1 the 2 this is again 2 1 the 2 2 1 the 2 and 2 9 the this is 18 so the values are very clear that this is 0 this is 3 and this is 5 and this value is 4 and 4 this is this will value will be 34 0 3 5 34 so i am writing here 0 3 5 and this is 34 so and after getting this what is r3 operation so r3 operation is nothing but r3 minus 2 r1 so r3 minus 2 r1 what is r3 here r3 is very clear 2 1 minus 1 0 in between there is minus and we have to multiply row 1 with 2 so this is row 1 so 2 1 the 2 this is also 2 1 the 2 this is 2 1 the 2 and 2 9 the 18 so the values here are this is 0 this is minus 1 this is uh, minus 3 and this is minus 18 so r3 will be row 3 will be 0 minus 1 minus 3 minus 18 so this value is 0 this is minus 1 minus 3 and this value is minus 18 see here there is a partition again so using this first diagonal element i made these two 0 and the next is, is, diagonal element is 3 using this i have to make this 3 r3 0 so for that the operation will be r3 affected as i have to multiply with 3 and add that's it that is 3 r3 plus row 2 see here what happens here so row 1 row 2 are undisturbed that is 1 1 1 and this one is 9 and here row 3 that is 0 this is 3 this is 5 and this value is 34 so only on um, r3 so here i am showing r3 here see here r3 will be 
row 3 operation will be this is 3 r3 plus r2 so 3 r3 so we have to multiply each and every term of r3 with 3 this is 0 so minus 1 into 3 is minus 3 so this is minus 3 into 3 is minus 9 and this value is minus 3 into 18 it is minus 54 in between there is plus what is r2 0 3 5 34 this is 0 this is 3 this is 5 and this is 34 the values are this is 0 this is 0 this is minus 4 and this is minus 20 so the values will be r3 will be 0 0 minus 4 and this value is minus 20 and it's very very clear that so in between there is a partition so this is matrix a and this whole thing is matrix a by b so we have to separate this one so we can write this in the form of see here we can write this in the form of this is 1 1 1 this is so first of all the rank of a here is the rank of a here is what 3 number of unzero rows and rank of a by b so here the whole thing this is a by b a by b matrix is also 3 so if rank of a is equal to rank of a by b the system is consistent so the system is consistent consistent if it's consistent it has a solution so it has a solution so which solution let's find out so this is 9 and this value is augmented matrix 3 5 and this is 0 0 this is minus 4 and this is 34 and this is minus 20 so this is our augmented matrix so again we have to find the solution for this so for finding the solution how we can write this one so we can write this one in the form of see here in the form of this is 1 1 1 0 3 5 and this is 0 0 minus 4 and in between so the unknowns are x y and z so which is equal to so this matrix this column matrix is b that is 9 34 and this is minus 20 so we have to frame an equation so 1 into x is x and this is 1 into y is y and this is 1 into z is z is equal to 9 and the next one 0 into x is 0 and 3 into y is this is 3y and 5 into z this is 5z is equal to this is 34 and here if i multiply that is 4z is equal to minus 20 so these these are 1 2 3 equations this is 1 this is 2 and this is 3 so from equation 3 we have See here, minus 4z is equal to minus 20, z is equal to minus 20 by minus 4 and z is equal to 5. So, I got my first value z is equal to 5. So, if I keep value of z in equation 2, so equation 2 implies, so this is 3y plus 5z is equal to 34. So, if I keep in place of z as 5, is equal to 34 then see 3y plus 25 is equal to 34 and 3y is equal to 34 minus 25 and 3y will be see here this value is uh, 9 and y is equal to 9 by 3 and y value is 3 so i got even the value of 3 i got z value as a 5 and y value as 3 now I will substitute in equation 1. What is equation 1? x plus y plus z is equal to 9. So, this is x plus y plus z is equal to 9. So, I want the value of x. x. So, for that y, I am substituting as 3 and z as 5 is equal to 9. So, x plus 8 is equal to 9. So, x is equal to 9 minus 8 and x value is equal to 1. So, the solution for the system of equations that is x, y, z values are nothing but. So, the x value here is 1, y value here is 3 and z value, see here the z value is nothing but 5. So, this is how we have to solve. So, it's so simple that let me explain you. First of all, we have to Write it in the form of the system of equations can be written as Ax is equal to B. So, this is the column matrix. And the next one we have to frame an augmented matrix. So, we have to check the ranks of A, 
आ कमा ए कमा बी ए बाय बी सो हियर द रैंक ऑफ ए द रैंक ऑफ ए इज वेरी क्लियर दैट सो देर इज ए पार्टीशन हियर द रैंक ऑफ ए इज इक्वल टू थ्री एंड रैंक ऑफ ए बाय बी द होल मैट्रिक्स इज आल्सो थ्री इफ बोथ आर इक्वल इफ रैंक ऑफ ए इज इक्वल टू रैंक ऑफ ए बाय बी द सिस्टम इज कंसिस्टेंट एंड इट हैज अ सॉल्यूशन सो आई एम राइटिंग दिस इन द फॉर्म ऑफ अगेन ए एक्स इज इक्वल टू बी सो दिस इज ए ए मैट्रिक्स एक्स वाई जेड अननोन्स एंड दिस इज द कॉलम मैट्रिक्स सो आफ्टर दैट आई गॉट थ्री इक्वेशंस so after solving i got the value of x y z as 1 3 and 5 thank you so much for watching and staying till the end um, please take time to raise your thumb if you really like pass it on to your friends and subscribe to this channel thank you so much